former governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, Godwin Emifili. The EFCC has five fresh charges against him, and uh, that would he will be arraigned in court uh, tomorrow. That's uh, on Monday. Now, where did um, all of these um, charges um, come from? This, this, this fresh charges is it from the report submitted by the special um, investigator appointed by President Bolatin to look into the books of the CBN? No, the, 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 you know, there are, there are now two charges. First of all, there was a charge before the FCC High Court for which he was arraigned. He, at the first instance, it was a six-count charge, which eventually was amended to 20-count charge. That trial is still ongoing, but this is a fresh arraignment that will happen in Lagos. It, what's happened in law enforcement is that the fact that the charge was referred against you in the case does not mean that if the commission has further evidence that they cannot bring additional charges against you, which is what is planning out now. So we simply have fresh information that we want to charging for. And the essence of doing that is that if you file a charge, for instance, the matter in Abuja is a money laundering charge. If you have other evidence that you want to see, probably want to recover proceeds of crime, and that information is not before the court, the court cannot give you what you didn't ask for. So we simply have fresh evidence that we want to take on. That's why we are ready. So this, this fresh evidence now, is it connected with the report of that special investigator appointed by President no, Tinubu? EFCC is not working solely based on the report of the special investigator. But that can be a basis for further action by you EFCC. You have seen that report? EFCC has seen Definitely, that report. EFCC has, has access to that report. But mm. we are not working solely on the strength of that report. The Commission has the power to generate its own investigation. Mm. Because, you know, the statement from the presidency says, with the completion of that assignment given to uh, Mr. Jim Obazi, all appropriate law enforcement and regulatory agencies are already conducting follow-up action. So that's what I'm asking now. What's the ESS's follow-up action in this regard? I, I can't come on television now to start telling you uh, a, a secret of trade. I've told you that we have access to the report, mm. and we have, start, we have started with a fresh charge against him. Mm. Where that is going to stop, I can't, I can't tell you now, but we're on top of the situation.